me, being a caretaker is all about leading by example. And that means being a passionate but responsible person in these mountains. And I want people to feel really welcome when they come here. I want them to feel like they can walk into the place where I live and it's their home too for the night. But I want them also to understand that I feel really strongly that this is a place that we need to come to with humility. I feel most myself when I'm in the mountains. I really appreciate that space and having that time to think and having that time where I'm focused on just my surroundings and my body and being able to feel like I'm part of that environment is really important for me in preparing myself to go into the rest of my life. The Randolph Mountain Club is a small mountain club that was started in 1910. And it's very community focused, community based, volunteer led organization. For a volunteer led organization to be maintaining 100 miles of trails and four shelters is a really impressive feat. I've worked for a lot of different organizations in the mountains and what they're able to do just on a community and volunteer basis is really remarkable. Waking up here in the mountains is one of my favorite parts of the job. Right from the get-go, we're getting the weather forecast from Mount Washington, talking to the guests we were here the night before, helping them plan their hike for the day. Um, there's really hard to beat sitting on the porch, drinking your coffee and watching the sunrise while you talk to the new friends that you met the night before about where, what adventures you're all gonna go have that day. I love being able to spend time with people in the mountains, and I also love time alone in the mountains. There's a focus and there's a different pace that happens in the mountains that really, when you're with other people, fosters intimacy, and when you're alone, fosters a type of inwardness and introspection that I really value. For many people, just getting to Treeline is a full day hike, and having a place like Crag Camp that is affordable and right at Treeline gives them the opportunity to spend the night. A lot of times this is a way that makes it accessible for them to explore this area and have that life-changing experience that we all associate with the mountains. Everybody wants to find a special, unique experience here and being able to help people do that is so gratifying, and especially getting to see kids who are up here for the first time. And, you know, we just had a seven-year-old here last night and her, Enthusiasm for hiking and wanting to come back in the winter just gets you really excited and reminds you why this is something that I've spent my life doing. I want everyone to be able to get into these mountains because I think that they're the best place in the world, but I also want them to come with a sense of humility and a sense of respect for themselves and for the place that they're coming to. Having organizations like the RMC that maintain trails and cabins like this is vital to people being able to access these areas. Being able to experience our public lands is one of the most important things that we can do to encourage people to value conservation and public lands. By being able to come out and hike on trails and spend the night in the mountains, people have a very different experience than they would have just driving through the area or seeing pictures or reading about this. Um, and that really is important to fostering a connection with wild places and understanding their value and why we need to protect them for future generations. Mm -hmm.